Country Garden barely keeping his head above water after being uh, just a few months ago China's biggest developer. Where are we at? So the, the Ringgit bond news you just mentioned um, is uh, pretty significant, but the, do, uh, the in terms of a uh, dollar amount, is pretty small. So as an investor or creditor of the company, uh, they should be looking beyond the headline. So bear in mind, you know, this is a company just posted seven, nearly seven billion dollar in record losses last year, and at the same time, the company warned that it may have, you know, uh, uh, it, it may have problem meeting its financial obligation if the financial performance continue to deteriorate, and also, you know, it said. Uh, uh, it, it, you know, the, the company is facing material, material uh, uncertainties that may raise its concern over its ability to continue as a going concern. So, pretty serious warning. So, you know, the company has a total of $35 billion in debt uh, on its book, and, and including uh, $15 billion material in the next 12 months. You know. And the company uh, also said, you know, the, the, it, it will be able to uh, meet its financial obligation, you know, uh, if the sales, uh, its sales continue to. Uh, uh, if sales recover and also uh, its talks with creditor continue, uh, whatever the, uh, the, 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 in, the, in the capital market investors you know, have shown pessimism of their company's outlook, you know, its stocks are, have fallen nearly 70% from its peak, and also the dollar bond of the company is trading slightly over 10 cents on the dollar. Uh, and because of that, the overall dollar, junk dollar bond market offshore, which is mostly issued by Chinese uh, developers, are trading at distress level. It's uh, at the lowest since um, the beginning of this year. Country's biggest, right? Is there any idea of what the kind of policy or rescue end game might look like for not just Country Garden but the broader sector? Because there is this view that, you know, is it too big to fail but also perhaps too big for the government to be able to save? Yeah, the, uh, the Chinese government has realized the, 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 the problem in the property market. It's threatening to drag down the whole economy. Um, so that's why over the past few months, you have seen a series of measures from lower borrowing you know, costs for home buyers and also you know, threshold for, uh, for a down payment threshold for, for, for purchases. However, um, um, the, the, the sales you know, has not picked up yet. Uh, it's because you know, investors' confidence remained low following three years COVID uh, restriction. They are not confident about their future income. Uh, and also, you know, the, uh, in the, in the, the job, uh, the market is all doom and gloom. The you know, youth unemployment rate uh, is about uh, more than 20 percent, pretty scary. Um, uh, last week, the policy announced by the by the Chinese government to uh, lower the interest rates of existing mortgage uh, is a big move. Uh, and over the weekend, state media have been reported that uh, uh, the, there is some you know, renewed interest in uh, home purchase. However, uh, it takes some time to uh, to show whether uh, there is a genuine you know uh, buying interest. Uh, traditionally, September October is a strong month for property sales. You know, uh, so let's wait and see.